I learned a long time ago that there's no sense getting all riled up every time a bunch of idiots give you a hard time. In the end, the universe tends to unfold as it should. Plus, I have a really large penis. That keeps me happy. Gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to Tony and his lovely ex. Now, for a moment here, I want you to, you know, we're going to mark you on out here, Tony. I right? just, just soak her in right quick. And I don't like, like, really, check her out. Look at those eyes, yo. She, right. she is definitely not bad. She is not bad at all. But, once again, X, not bad. But this one right here, yeah, yeah, on the Richter scale, comparatively speaking, definitely, definitely a baddie. Which is what leads us to right here. Well, our boy Tony has uh, seemed to have made a few changes in his life. This is coming to us from the New York Post. Ukrainian refugee who broke up home of host couple blames ex-girlfriend, written by Selmy Algar. British man Tony Garnett left his girlfriend of 10 years for Sofia Karkadem, a Ukrainian refugee the couple was hosting. Oh, sweetie, you let it in your home. You, you should have, the second, the second it showed up, you should have been like, nah, but he would have been like, shit, it really don't matter what you have to say. <laughs> a Ukrainian refugee who broke up the relationship of a British couple that took her in said her man's jilted ex only has herself to blame. Sophia, yeah, Sophia Karkadam, 22, fled the war-torn city of Lviv and was generously taken in by security guard Tony Garnett, 29, and his then-girlfriend Lorna in the UK earlier this month. Oh! Damn! It took a month! Jesus Christ! Oh, man. It just... Fellas, is any of us, like, sitting here, like, just purely on a physical... I, yeah, yeah, I don't, they, I, I mean, they're, they're, they're chicks, dude, like, yo, they're all pink on the inside, they're, they're of equal headache, you know, but, you know, we've definitely come across a, a, a bit of a, you know, the, the, the younger model, the, the, the replacement. Damn, it only took a month. But after only 10 days, sparks began to fly between Karkadam and the heavily tattooed humanitarian and father of two. Oh, that was your baby mother too, bruh. Karkadam, who was an IT professional in the Ukraine, blamed Lorna's spiraling suspicions for pushing her into Garnett's arms. Well, I mean, shit, is it really suspicion when it happens? <laughs> yo, you, like, yo, you real, Lorna, Lorna, the second she popped up. You should have been, no, no, no. Hey, take care of home, sis. Her constant suspicions, the tension, it just pushed me and Tony closer together, Karkadam told the son. She created this situation by constantly suggesting something was going on when it wasn't. So this is her fault. I mean, she says she kind of spoke the shit into existence, even though, I mean, really, Really, you should have just. I, I really, you should really should have just angled the threesome. Y'all really should just knock it out with threesome. It is what it is. Hey, congratulations! Now you take penal duties too. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all could have worked this shit out and all been one big happy family. But you know, somebody uh wants to be very territorial. Karkadam claimed her host relationship was already faltering badly by the time she rolled into town. Yeah, and gasoline on a motherfucking fire as far as i'm concerned they destroyed their relationship long before i arrived she said their relationship was at fault none of this is my work mm, it, <laughs> it was my decision to leave when i did and tony decided to come with me oh gasoline gasolina all right the, do not the, you know, like, it, it's so cute how women will always, uh, you know, oh my goodness, no, I'm not at fault. That shit was always just a problem, you know. I just came in here with my perky ass titties and my pretty ass face and my bad and my banging ass body. I can, I can damn near guarantee you this shit got an ass on her. Oh my goodness. And but she's not bad, like yo, like bro, you really should have been just twerking this into a freaking Betty and Veronica threesome type situation. You really, could, I think, could have angled that. You know, I don't know none of these people. I'm just saying. 
like perfect world, right? Garnett eventually evacuated from his relationship with Lorna and is now planning a future with Carcadum. The refugee said her family has disowned her over the episode, arguing that oh, that uh, that other potential hosts will think twice before welcoming Ukrainians into their homes. Yeah, yeah. Honestly, you should be very, very cautious as to whoever you bring into your home. But uh, okay, so this is a. Uh, this is uh, uh, another shot of Lorna here. You never stood a fucking chance, yo. <laughs> Holy shit. You did not stand a just Guys, guys, huh? 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 No, like, like you can, like, because like, this is one of those pictures where, yeah, the, the, like, sitting down, good angle, everything else like that. When you catch up in this bad angle, like, yeah, you can kind of see, like, you know, that the, 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 the mom wear and tear and the like. And this, this right here comes just swans, or come, comes waltzing through the door, sis, you should have, you should have, nah, we good a lot, like, before with the, Mm -mm -mm, slam the door in the face straight up like oh hey what oh never mind Boom. but nope 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 you let it on in but despite this, the, the tensions um encircling them garnett and Karkinum are still thriving i know it sounds shit what has gone on but you deal with the cards you've been dealt garnett said to me the cards i got it was a no for my man <laughs> I'd rather be on my ass now and happy knowing I've done the right thing. Oh! Uh, you, uh, yo, like, come on. For real? For real? He ain't do the right thing here. He ain't do the right thing here. I mean, yeah, you real pretty, sweetheart, but, um, shit. My man. My man. <laughs> Tony! Tony! Uh, it was like the Latunza highest. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch, you did it. Ah, oh, Tony. Oh, oh my God. Uh, I was really sitting here like, man, do I really want to do a video today? And you know, am I going to come across anything that's just going to really make it worthwhile? Oh, did I, boys? Did I? So with that being said, we're going to bring this one to an end. All the internet stuff. If you like it, so us a like. Dislike, go ahead. Do that too. Nobody see it. You sub. You enjoy my fan He really said, um, man, we play the cards we dealt. <laughs> Holy shit. So good. <laughs> like, yo, I got dealt a badass 22-year-old Ukrainian shit. My man. Yo, legend. Legend, yo, Tony, my brother Garnett, man, you, you, you are definitely legend for this shit, my dude. All right, pretty like, yo, just, the, just the, you're like, yo, we play the cards, we dealt. I got a fucking, I got a fucking banger. We good. Uh, <clears throat> so back to it. If you like it, toss it a like. Just like, go ahead, dude. I do nobody's scared of you. Sub, you enjoy my fantastic voice. You want to get videos like this every single day? Share because sharing is caring. And YouTube, I bet you, like, aren't the biggest fans of your boy over here for very obvious reasons. Bang the bell for notifications. Get something from Teespring. Check me out on Patreon, on Odyssey, and Rumble, and all the other fun stuff as well. Links in the description. Actually, go into the description box and do damage and speak. Let me know. What do you guys think in the comments? <sighs> Jesus Christ. Tony. Tony, you're a legend, mate. And that's coming from an American. I'm calling you a mate because that's how you all speak over there in the UK. Mate, mate, you're you're a legend, mate. All right? I, I have absolutely nothing but the utmost respect for you. In the name of the Queen and all that's good, you definitely, definitely knocked it out the fucking park. Good on you there, mate. <laughs> Guys, let me know what you think in the comments. And until the next one. You lose me nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer. Every breath I take without your permission raises my self-esteem.